Nako. Can you hear everyone's voices? The people do not wish for a world enveloped in fog. There are times when they'll stop and think they can't go another step. But please, grant everyone's wishes. Bring light to people's hearts. Marie. Please get up. Just once more. The heart of those you form the deepest bond would become your strange. Izanagi. Izanagi has transfigured into Izanagi no Okami. Okay, next battle. Impossible! Can the will of so few surpass the will of all mankind? You withstood the attack. You withstood the attack. How can your powers rival mine. You withstood the attack. You withstood the attack. Why don't you understand? It's impossible for humans to grasp the truth with their own hands. There's nothing you can do but do this. Skill? Very assured. The world of power that beneath all the world's curse and falsehood. Very assured for Ikanami. Izanami no Okami. Be. How could I be defeated? How am I the one to disappear? Instead of the endless struggle, wouldn't it be easier to wrap oneself in lies and live in blissful ignorance? Isn't that true peace for humans? How many times do we have to tell you? The hell with that shit! The hell with that shit. Stop assuming you know us! <laughs> Very well. Then try and live your way. Power enough to erase my existence. You have already exceeded what I thought humanity to be capable of. You have lifted the fog in this world, as well as the fog in your own. Oh, so the TV world has no fog. And whether that will lead to happiness or not, rests upon your shoulders. Children of man, well done. All right, we did it. Uh, thank goodness. It's really over now. Yep, 
This time it's all over! It seems this is more like a beginning for us, though. Well, now we've got no regrets for tomorrow. France that you can believe in and the many people you have come to understand. A strong heart bound to others trying to ascertain the truth. A firm belief in grasping the truth with your own hand without being misled or deceived. The power of those things has broke judgment down on what deceived mankind, opening the door to a new tomorrow. Marie, golden ending. Welcome back. I love you with... Like you, with no hat around your head. Everything's finally over. You really are incredible. I'm no match for you. You just fought the other me that split from my personality. The two Sagiri, the other me, and the me that is speaking with you right now. They were all originally one within me. So many of you. But there was nothing I could have done without my powers. If not for you, I would have disappeared along with the fog when the hollow forest vanished. Thank you so much. Don't tell me you're gonna go. You saved everything. I'll be all right. The fragments you defeated have returned to me and will soon become one. My name is Izanami no Mikoto. The fertile will that protects those who live in this land and fulfills their wishes. I will not forget you. Please don't go. Please do not forget. I am always by your side. <laughs> How marvelous! You have driven back a godly being and brought about a new world! This will be the last time we summon you here. Soon, the fog will lift and our destination will be visible. We will be arriving shortly. This journey was a fruitful one. Worthy of marking a turning point in your destiny. Many a time along the way did the fog of lies prevent you from moving forth. Yet in every instance, you overcame the temptation of easy exits and false terminals. False terminals, right. In forging bonds with those precious to you, you move closer to the truth, one step at a time. And my heart danced with delight to see you succeed. I am most honored to have borne witness to such a wondrous journey. Our destination is close at hand now. Well then, we have finally come to your journey's true end. Our contract has been fulfilled. My own duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. Now, go forth and see with your own eyes. See the world you have won, the bright, magnificent future. So, Igor, kick us out. Nice. It feels kind of nostalgic. 
I know this place. This scenery. A long, long time ago, everywhere in this world used to look like this. So this is the world inside people's hearts. And I'm going to cry. The town's fox and the fox from the other world have all been clear. The human heart has the strength to shine through the clouds of lies and uncertainty. You and your friends were able to prove that fact. And that will remain true until the end of time. Yo. Well, this is it. You really are leaving, huh? It hasn't really hit me yet. No more senpai from t tomorrow on! Hey, quit crying. It's way too soon for that. Jeez, um, that, that stuff's kind of contagious, you know? You know? Can't you but to cry? We gotta put on a good face for Senpai. Big bro? I don't want you to go away. Nanako, didn't you promise that you wouldn't cry? Building a case against Adachi is going pretty smoothly. After all, he's made a full confession to his crimes. There haven't been any more incidents since then. Inaba's finally back to its normal, peaceful self. And Nanako's better now too. I couldn't ask for anything more. Thanks for everything. To me, you're just as much a part of this family as Nanako. I'm really glad you came to stay with us. Sensei, I finally found a place for me. That's why I'm going back over there. To make sure it never goes wrong again, I'm going to protect that world from now on. I can finally be proud and say that world is where I belong. Man, Senpai, this town's gonna feel empty without you. How cruel! W were you even listening? We can see you anytime we want, you dork. Yeah, you dork. Like you'll be gone long. Soon as you start craving something like ice cream, you'll be back in a flash. <laughs> come on, my honeys. Bluffing that way isn't very cute, you know. You're just going to be going in and out of the TV at Juness. How's that different from what you've been doing? Um, I can't quite decide what to do. At first, I only planned on staying here until the case was completely closed. Maybe I should stick to my original plan and take the train back with you, Senpai. <laughs> Kidding, of course. I couldn't do something like that. It's not as though we'll never see each other again. Feel free to call me anytime, even if there isn't a case to solve. I don't feel like saying goodbye either. Hey, you got any plans during the long holiday in May? If you're free, come over and visit. With no mysteries to solve, we can have some real fun. I'll make reservations now so that we can stay in my family's inn. Ooh, I can get my revenge for that night. Our surprise sneak attack will work for sure this time. 
don't bring that up, you stupid bear! Hey, what happened to going back to that world? That has nothing to do with this. It's entirely different. That reminds me. She's not here. I would have thought that she would come today at least. Boosh. Boo. Are you talking about Mary? I was wondering about that too. Are you talking about Murray? Oh yeah. I haven't seen her ever since... <clears throat> Is she doing okay? I think so. I'm pretty sure she's fine. She's in our hearts. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Oh, so Emmy Chan went back there, huh? Oh my, I've got a hottie for a neighbor now. What should I do? Oh, is that what you meant? Oh, I thought something bad had happened to her. Why'd you have to say it like that? <laughs> well, as long as she's doing well, that's okay. Hey! Stop ignoring me! But back to a serious note, she should have at least shown up here since this is the last time we'll see you. <laughs> this isn't the last time! Stupid Moronji! Stupid Moronji! Why do you have to say things like that too? <laughs> It's almost time. You better get on the train. Come back anytime you want. We can eat ramen again. Me and Daisuke will definitely come crash at your place someday. Yeah. If anything happens, you can always come back here. I'll be waiting for you. Thanks for everything. Please take care. As soon as I can look out for myself. I'll go see you. Well, see ya. Good luck over there, too. If anything happens on your end, we'll come running! Until we meet again, Senpai. Senpai, I'll be waiting for you. See ya. Take care. I'll be looking forward to seeing you again. Well, be careful. I'll see you, big bro. Bye-bye. <laughs> Thank you for everything! Stay well until we meet again someday! You'll always be my sensei forever! You better not run away too, senpai! I'll always remember our time together! Distance doesn't matter to us! Even if we're separated, we're still friends! Yeah. Hey, See you again, oh, sensei! Bye. 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 Looks like you separate with your real friend and it's make you cry. He's really gone. It's sad that he won't be around, but we will be okay, right guys? Doesn't matter how far apart we are. The bonds we've made will remain strong. Everyone's heart is connected to the people they know and trust. It's those bonds that let us all search for our purpose in life. As long as it's a purpose you believe in, there will always be someone who can help you fulfill it. You, me, and everyone else, there are no barriers. Our hearts are one. Right, Sensei? Right. Man, it's so sad. 